Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you the easy way how you can install AppLinked to your Fire Stick or Android TV. The whole process is super easy and will take you only a couple of minutes. So first of all, you have to get an app called the Loader. You can get it for free from the official Amazon App Store or a Google Play Store, depending on your device. To do so, just go to search on your Fire Stick. Here it is. And there in the search bar, start typing the Loader. And here's the Loader application. It already popped out for us at the bottom, so there was even no need to enter the whole name of the app. Then you click on the loader, and basically that's the application which you need to get to your device. But after you get the loader, it's not over yet, we still have to set it up. And to set up the loader, we'll go to settings, here we are, click on that gear icon, then go down until you see My Fire TV. Open it, and here we have to enable developer options for your device. However, on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new ones, the developer options might be hidden by default. So if that's the case, don't worry, it's really easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times. And do it fast, so let's do it. Now as you can see at the bottom it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. In your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. And if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which have appeared right here. Open them, make sure to enable ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps, and turn that option on for the loader. So what it does is going to allow you to install other applications from the internet, especially those which are not available in the official Amazon App Store, and that's exactly what we're planning on doing right now. So now let's go to the list of applications on your device. Here it is, and here we have the loader app, which we just downloaded and set up. However, before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which I really recommend doing, and it's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN, because it's super fast, they got a great application for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, tablets, or pretty much any other device. And they're not expensive, and actually they cost less than a cup of coffee per month which is a great pricing. In the VPN app, you just connect to any server, and from the moment you connect, all your internet traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means nobody is going to be able to track you or snoop on you online. And that really helps you stay out of trouble when downloading something from the internet. And if you are interested in getting a VPN, or just giving it a try, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in the pinned comment below this video, you'll get 4 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing deal. So go get those 4 months for free, and then use the loader safely. Now let's finally open the loader. On the left side menu, make sure to click on Home, and there in that search bar we'll have to type a link, which you'll see on the screen in a moment. So here's the link, you can see it on the screen now, it's applinked.store, make sure to enter the link exactly as you see on the screen, because if you make any mistakes, the link is not going to work properly, and then click on go. And now, in a couple of seconds, the applinked website is going to open, yep, here it is. Here they instantly give you a warning to beware of copycat websites, so just close that warning, and then scroll down a little bit, and you'll see we download the app button. Click on it, and now the download has started. Click on install in the right bottom corner, and then after the app has been installed, do not press on open yet, instead click on done, because here we'll have an option to delete the installation file, as we don't need it anymore. So click on delete, and then delete once again. Now let's finally go to the list of applications on your device. So here it is, click on it, and when it opens, just scroll down, and here's the app linked application which you just installed. Now I would recommend you to click on the options button on your remote, that's the bottom three horizontal lines. Click on it and then press and move to front. This way, app linked application is always going to be at the very top of your app list, and it's going to be very easy for you to access the application every time you need it. Then once again, don't forget to use a VPN when downloading something from the internet to stay out of trouble. And once again, the link to a great offer for NordVPN is going to be in the pinned comment below this video. If you follow the link, you'll get 4 months of NordVPN for free. Then you can finally open up Link's application, and from here you can either add a store, go to your saved stores, delete stores, browse the public stores, or browse through the categories, which you can see on the screen. 
And pretty much that's it, that's the easy way how you can get app linked to your Fire Stick in 2024. If the video is helpful, make sure to click on the like button so more people would see it as well. And see you next time, bye bye.